my name is John on this channel. We talk all things physical media, some movies, music, and books, you know, that kind of thing. Go ahead and subscribe down below for more of that kind of content. Well, friends, this is a pickups video, um, and I have some incredible mail from some incredible friends uh, in the collecting community. I've got uh, some great stuff from Goodwill and one thing from the new Dollar Tree wave. So anyway, friends, I hope you're doing really well, and this is what I've picked up as of late. So from the Dollar Tree new wave, apparently just hit today, I think. It was supposed to hit today. I went last night to my Dollar Tree. I had to stop there. And I found nothing for movies, but I found one CD that I was interested in. And it is He Is Legend, Suck Out the Poison. Uh, this is a Solid State Records album. And them and Tooth and Nail, I typically will pick up their stuff if I find it out pretty cheap. And uh, so anyway, I'm looking forward to checking out this one. It wasn't a dollar. It was a dollar twenty-five because the prices got hiked by a quarter. But anyway, really excited to check that one out. Next, I'll show you what I picked up at Goodwill. And recently, I found some unbelievable stuff uh, at Goodwill. So the first two, I've got some music, some movies, and books. That's what the channel's about, friends. So the first one is, and this is in pristine condition. This was at a, a Goodwill uh, just a little ways away from me. And uh, the artwork is perfect. The actual vinyl is perfect. And it is... Um, it is movie related. It is the music from the motion picture soundtrack out of Africa, uh, music composed and conducted by John Barry. And this vinyl is in pristine condition. So I was really excited to find this for a dollar. Again, friends, if you're watching this channel, um, I'm trying to build my vinyl collection, uh, spending no more than like a dollar or two per vinyl. And so anyway, I'm up over 10 now with some stuff that I love, uh, only paying a dollar or two each. Uh, so far, just a dollar each. So out of Africa, and then this next one, uh, this last vinyl I'll show you, I found this and I was so pumped. The second I saw it, I couldn't believe it. And like you find in Goodwill stores, if you open up the vinyl, uh, quite often it's scratched up. And this one, I was just like praying, please don't be scratched. I'm so excited for this. And it wasn't. Uh, there's a couple small little stains on the artwork, but other than that, everything is fantastic. And it is Mahalia. Uh, Mahalia Jackson is who this is. And I've got two CDs of her music. And she is an unbelievable artist. And her voice was incredible. The music she put out was unbelievable. And I highly, highly recommend anything you find, Mahalia Jackson. And to find this vinyl in the pristine condition, I was so excited. Again, just a couple little marks on the artwork. But other than that, this is in outstanding condition. So this is probably my prized possession uh, for when it comes to my vinyl collection. So excited to have found that record. So those are the vinyls I found at my local Goodwill. And then I found two CDs there. Uh, this first one is a band I'm really into and didn't have this album. And it is Jimmy, Jimmy Eat World, Chase This Light. I think I have one or two other albums on CD, but looking to uh, fill out that uh, discography. And then the other one is one that I remember almost buying when it came out in 2006, 2007. And I didn't. And I... Um, I always wanted to have it to listen through it, and I found it factory sealed. It is a Family Force 5, and I can uh, business up front and party in the back. This is the Diamond Edition, and again, this one is factory sealed. So, really excited to check this out. I do know one of the songs off this album, which is why I was always interested in listening to the whole album, but excited to finally have this and to be able to get to check it out. And then two more things from Goodwill, and then I've got some insane mail that friends have sent me uh, recently. Uh, this is uh, a season of TV that I'm really excited to check out. 1986-87. Uh, uh, this does feature, one episode does feature Betty White, which was also a huge selling point for me. And it is uh, Mama's Family. So I'm really excited. I don't have any seasons of this show in my collection. So to have this one is really exciting. So glad to find this one. And the first disc had like some minor, like small, small scratches. Other than that, it's in pristine condition. And then uh, one book for you, and then we'll get into some other stuff. Uh, this is one that I've wanted for a long time, actually, this exact edition, and I found it in like-new condition. And it is F. Scott Fitzgerald Classic Works, two novels and 19 short stories. Uh, in particular, I wanted it for um, Benjamin Button's story, The Curious Case of Benjamin Button. And there you go, friends. So I'm excited to have this and to have found it for a dollar in like new condition. Can't beat that. So friends, my Goodwills recently um, have been outstanding. Really excited about that. And now everything else I want to show you is all movies and it is from friends in the movie collecting community. And I'm floored and just feel really, really humbled that anyone would send me any mail. But to have friends send you stuff is really cool. So the first uh, few are from my friends Donna and Lou here on YouTube. And they sent me a kind note. So thank you very much for that, Donna and Lou. Uh, we uh, share an effect 
affection for older films. All of us do. And uh, so they sent me some that they knew I'd be into. Uh, this first one is a double feature and it is a uh, featuring Humphrey Bogart. It is Beat the Devil and Call It Murder. So I am a big Humphrey Bogart fan, so this will be fun to check out for sure. And next are two that they said they found at Dollar Tree, and I'd never seen these thin case ones at Dollar Tree, but when I was there last night, I did, but I didn't see anything like this, any older black and white films. So this was neat. And the first one is starring uh, one actor who I really enjoy, Fred McMurray, and it is Don't Trust Your Husband. Looking forward to checking that out. I am a big fan of his. And then uh, Without Honor. I have not heard of this one either. So really excited to check out both of these. Uh, Donna and Lou, thank you so much for thinking of me and sending those my way. I really do appreciate it. That is so kind and generous and thoughtful of you. So thank you very much, friends. And I hope you get a channel up soon because I can't wait to see your collection as well. Uh, next is um, a package that I received from my friend Tim, Tim Talks Talkies. All his contact information will be below. Follow him on Instagram, subscribe to his channel here on YouTube. He's a phenomenal guy, great guy. And he sent me, he had messaged me and asked if I had uh, or wanted or needed any of these titles. And he sent me a picture. And there were three that I would love to uh, upgrade, I said. And I said, so no, let me know uh, what you need, what you're looking for. Or maybe we'll do a trade for these. And he just went ahead and sent them my way. So I will certainly be hopefully finding him some stuff soon to send his, his, and send his way. And uh, these are all three that I was really excited to upgrade. Uh, the first one is E.T. on 4K, which will be really, really fun to watch in 4K. I did get to... Um, uh, has a Blu-ray and 4K in there. So really excited to uh, have both of those, both formats. Uh, the next one is a film that I love, same thing, uh, Blu-ray and 4K, and it is V for Vendetta. Really love this film, excited to see this in 4K. And the last one is one that I've heard from countless people say you have to watch this in 4K, and I just watched it for the first time this year you know, on Blu-ray. First time ever seeing the film, but now I get to watch it in 4K, which will be a lot of fun. And this one is Jaws. So really excited to see this in 4K. So Tim, thank you so much, man. I was really floored and uh, humbled that you'd send these my way. And uh, so anyway, again, friends, check out everything that Tim puts out. He puts out some really great content and uh, has become a good friend here on YouTube and on Instagram. So anyway, Tim, thank you so much. I really do appreciate it, man. Looking forward to diving into those. And then last, but certainly not least, um, I talk about her on this channel all the time, Stephanie from Movie Chatter. All of her contact information will be uh, down below. She has become a very, very dear friend. And uh, she told me she was sending something my way recently. And um, I thought it was one title. And uh, she asked if I, I did have it in my collection. And I said I did not. And then she sent me more than one title. And I was absolutely floored. So Stephanie, Thank you so much, my friend. I really do appreciate it. Um, the first one is a Paramount Presents uh, uh, film. And this one is from 1981. And it is Faye Dunaway in um, Mommy Dearest. And this, of course, uh, with the slip, comes with the uh, original poster artwork. So Mommy Dearest. Uh, next one is one that is actually an upgrade for me. I did have this on DVD. Um, haven't got to see it yet. Uh, so now I'll get to watch it for the first time on Blu-ray. And so this is really, really cool. Uh, this one is from 1964, starring one of my favorites, Cary Grant. This is an Olive Signature uh, release, and it is of Father Goose. So it's really, really, I love this artwork so much. And it uh, comes with a really neat slip box, clear case. So this is amazing. Really, really excited to see this one on Blu-ray. Um, the next one is also a film I've never seen before and really excited to check this one out. Uh, this is from a year. I was looking to fill in two more years uh, to do a video on a film that I have in my collection that I love from every year since I've been born. I didn't have one from the year I was born. I have one now. I'm looking forward to checking this one out. This stars one of my all-time favorites in uh, Robert De Niro. It also is Meryl Streep, Christopher Walken, and it is The Deer Hunter. And this is the uh, Shout Select edition. This comes with slipcover. So this is wild. I couldn't believe this. And this is uh, on 4K as well. So really excited to watch that one for the first time. Uh, next is a steelbook. I don't have a huge steelbook collection. Uh, this is a 4K Blu-ray edition of a fantastic film, which will look unbelievable in 4K. Never seen it in 4K. And it is 1917. So um, a steelbook and a 4K um, Stephanie, uh, this is crazy. I'm super humbled by this. So thank you so much. Really excited to watch that one in 4K. 
um, the one that she told me she was sending, and then I have another one. This is the one she told me she was sending and really excited to see this in 4K. I have seen the film a few times and I absolutely love it. And it is uh, Tom Hanks in The Green Mile. Uh, this is on 4K with Slip. So this is the one she originally had asked if I had, and I didn't. She sent it my way, and uh, thank you so much, Stephanie. And then last, but certainly not least, um, I learn so much from Stephanie on her channel all the time. But in particular, when it comes to Criterion stuff, um, I'm always looking at when she, whatever she recommends, uh, I trust her recommendations. Uh, this is a Criterion film. It is a newer release, and so that floored me. This is from 1990. It is uh, 113 minutes. It's in color. It is spine number 1112. And it is a Joel and Co uh, Ethan Cohen film, and it is Miller's Crossing. I've never seen this film, did not have it in the collection, and uh, really excited to add to the collection and to add another criterion to my collection. Stephanie, this all floored me, blew me away. So super humbled and thankful. So thank you so, so much for sending that all my way. Um, Stephanie, thank you so much. Tim, thank you so much. Donna and Lou, thank you so much. Genuinely humbling. And so I appreciate it. Um, and I, Appreciate you being great friends. So, friends, this is what I picked up recently through mostly Goodwill, One Dollar Tree, and then just incredible generosity from friends in the movie collecting community. So, thank you so much for watching. Let me know if you've seen any of those. Comment down below. Uh, if you like this kind of stuff, feel free to hit like, subscribe, all those kinds of things. But I do appreciate you taking the time to check out this video. Thank you again to Donna and Lou, to Tim, to Stephanie, my friends. I really do appreciate it. Take care of yourselves, and uh, we'll see you next time. Oh,